Bruh. Nintendo really about to do this? Oh, man. That's right, what's up? All right. this news like the video man thumbs up all right we have some dope nintendo switch news items for this video but the first one is a shocker nintendo more than likely is going to be skipping e3 entirely this year this is why i say entirely they already stopped doing the live presentations. It's been a minute since they, they um, don't do the live presentations. But Nintendo always still had some kind of presence. They had the biggest showroom. Their showroom was like a miniature Disney World, bro. I remember when Breath of the Wild launched. That's when, that's when I went to E3. Bro, it's like they put you into Hyrule. You went through like a cave. It was crazy. But for the very first time, Nintendo is not listed on the exhibitors list. And so this is pretty major. This is the official. If you go to the E3 official website, Nintendo for the first time is not listed on the showroom floor for E3. Wow. And it causes you to wonder, is E3 well, E3, people have been saying E3 has been slowly declining. Nintendo would be the only reason why I would go go to E3. Well, actually, I went to E3 because they paid for my ticket. Shout out to Nintendo. But um, the only way I would go back is like if Nintendo has hardware or something like that. But it looks like they're not even going to be there at all. Now, I know dudes are raging. Oh, no. Has Nintendo abandoned us? Are we not getting a Nintendo Direct for E3? Yeah, we are. Don't have the side face. All right. Be glad. Um, <coughs> we are more than likely going to get still Nintendo's 45-minute um, E3 presentation, which is a digital stream. Has nothing really to do with being at E3. They could do that. We get, we get Nintendo Directs all the time. Where's the February Nintendo Direct, Nintendo? Come on, come on, it's Wednesday. We want an announcement. But the fact that they're not going to be at E3 is pretty big. You know what this means? All three major companies will not be at E3. Sony, um, PlayStation has already confirmed they're not going to E3. They're like, whatever, bro. We're not going to be at E3. And so Sony... It's not going to be at E3. My audio is lagging a little bit, but we're going to keep going. I'll fix it for the next video. <laughs> um, Sony is not going to be at E3. They've already um, said it. Microsoft is also not listed on the exhibitors list because what Microsoft does, they have their own presentation at another location. Presentation at another location, bars. Um, and so they're not going to be at E3 either and now nintendo has pulled the plug nintendo's gonna be a huge nintendo could have put the nail in the coffin for e3 right now because their show floor presence has been huge in the past and so um if they're not gonna be at e3 e3 is gonna be crickets this year bro um and I, i'll tell you does nintendo need e3 I have to say no, man. Sony didn't go to E3 last year. PlayStation 4 is still selling just fine. If Nintendo doesn't go to E3, have the show floor, and they still have their um, Nintendo Direct, their Digital Direct, um, the company's going to be fine, man. They're going to be all right. Um, the big thing is the games, and we just want to know like what new games are going to be at, at E3. 
Um, I think they're still going to be fine. St Switch is still going to be fine. So Nintendo, not at E3. And more <laughs> depressing. You want some more Nintendo depressing news? <laughs> Nintendo has announced four games. Four more game additions to Super Nintendo and NES. Now, I'm really not too upset. But I do get why people are upset. And they are, for the Super Nintendo, Poppin' Twin B. Don't sleep on Twin B. Twin B is better than people think. Um, and Smash Tennis for the Super Nintendo. For the NES, Shadow of the Ninja and Eliminator, Eliminator Boat Duel. <laughs> bro, this Shadow of the Ninja game looks straight like a Ninja Gated clone, bro. But, bro, check out the dislikes <laughs> on this video, bro. 57,000 like, five, no, 5.7 thousand likes, 7.8 thousand dislikes, bro. Dudes are raging, <laughs> right, rightfully so. But this is why I can't really complain. When they launched the Super Nintendo on the, um, any the online services, bro, they launched it with bangers, bro. Super Mario World, Super Metroid, Link to the Past. That's it. Those games alone, bro. Have you beaten all those Super Nintendo games that's come out yet? So stop disliking Nintendo's videos. <laughs> um, we still have a lot of great games, man, on, on the um, Super Nintendo server. So I'm not tripping too much. I just beat um, Punch Out, Super Punch Out, my favorite Punch Out game. And it's a part, of the bro. This is why I really don't trip too much, bro. We're only playing twenty dollars for the ent entire year. That's nothing, bro. And we're getting a lot of NES and Super Nintendo games. So I never really tripped with um, the NES and the Super Nintendo games. My biggest thing are the features for the Switch, bro. Achievements, bro. Come on, bro. Hey, horse. Where are you at, bro? Achievements, man. We beating that horse, bro. Beating that dead horse. Every time I talk about achievements, the dead horse is getting beat. All right. Next news item. Pokemon Home is now available. So Pokemon Home is now available and Pokemon Bank has been updated to version 1.5. So if you want to all your Pokemon collections in one place, get that Pokemon Home, boy. I'm not that big of a Pokemon fan to really utilize that. So it is what it is. And the last news item for this video i thought this was pretty cool too um switch lounges are coming to u.s airports and um if you want to see a picture of what it could possibly look like i have it right here bro i got you covered bro right here bro booyah um, this is a rendered image of what the possible switch lounges will be like at airports. I think that's going to be dope, bro. Because you're at the airport, you're waiting over for flights or whatever. Bro, you have the Nintendo Switch kiosk. If, if they do this anything like they do their mall presentations, we're at different malls, it's going to be pretty lit, bro. Great advertising, great mar marketing. Nintendo's been hitting it out the ballpark. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out. Bye. You're still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I got to hook you up. That's right. We're having monthly giveaways. $60 eShop codes for your Nintendo Switch. You can choose any game of your choice. How do you enter? One, subscribe. Make sure you're subscribed to this fire. Two, make sure you're following me on Twitter at Obi One Plays. And that's it. You're in for our monthly giveaways. But that's not it. It gets even better. Do you want to game with your boy every day? Do you want to join our private Nintendo Switch Gaming Discord? Become a member. Three ways to join. One, through YouTube. There's a join button right below this video. It's two, through Twitch. Twitch Prime. You can do it for free or just subscribe through Twitch. And number three, the third way to join, patreon.com backslash ob one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. See you later.